And welcome back, folks, to more of The Wolf Among Us. Start episode five. I believe this is probably the conclusion. At least I think it is. I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? <laughs> If I can avoid it. Yeah, the thing that started this all. No. Holly's sister, Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it. If he even gives a shit. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? We're destroying the tree. No! We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? I don't know. Snow will come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and... She doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Damn, so oh God, it's... Big B! This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Big B, wait. When you get the crooked man. Make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Here we go. So as I said, I think this is the conclusion to The Wolf Among Us. Uh, so far it's been a very fun game, and I've actually waited until I'm eating it. I, I've got, uh, I got the comics. And I was I was very interested in reading them, but I didn't want spoilers. I didn't want uh, I didn't want to know what happened before I knew what happened, so to speak. And from what I heard, there may have been some little spoilers into the story, in the books. And my cat is continuing to always be a pain in the ass whenever I try to record. At least some things never change, huh, Triss? You gonna constantly try and rub against my leg while I record? Sure you will. Cry wolf. You've come a long way. You must be tired. A little bit. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Please, Sheriff, relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really, a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. I'm here for one reason, and it's not to eat your fucking food. Really? Yeah. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna... Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. Hmm. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You're destroying this town. You've been doing it for ages. Destroying this town? What an earth do you mean what the hell do you think i mean slavery kidnapping extortion murder what would you call the wholesale corruption of fabled town i would call it the baseless accusation of a desperate sheriff how are you certain this isn't some conspiracy against me i'm a well-connected man well moneyed people do like to take their shots at me don't try to play me it won't work i'm not trying to control you 
I have no need for treachery, Bigby. I do everything right out in the open. But I can understand the confusion, and I'm truly sorry about the trouble all this has caused you. And I hope you believe me when I say, Sheriff, that I sincerely mean to make it up to you. The really? recent murders that have gotten such attention as of late. I don't relish telling you that they were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you and to assure you that it's over with. An unfortunate bit of business? You're gonna tell me right now who killed him? Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? The man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? I'm the law here, not you. Now tell me who did it. You think I'm scared of you? <laughs> You're nothing more That's than That's enough. I saved you. I was hoping it. it wouldn't oh, come to this, but in the interest of preserving our alliance, the Queen of Hearts. If you have to know, it was Georgie. Wait, what? What? However, like I said, I'd be handling the matter if you don't mind. What? Georgie, you got what you wanted, so just sit. No. Down now. No. No. You're the fall yeah, man. I killed him, so what? No, you didn't. You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. Why'd you do it? Why kill them? You didn't do it. Does it matter? Look, yeah. The fact is, George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you far exceeded yours. What? But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this. And then you attempt me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss what to do with you. No. This is right, bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this. So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? He didn't you can do have it. Georgie. Consider it a gift, ensuring our continued cooperation. I think I'll be taking both of you. You're not taking me, you fucking ponce. What the fuck is this shit? You said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with them, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I'll give a fuck if I'm the one? Who the shit do you think you fuck us around? Get the fuck out of here. I do apologize, Sheriff. But I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit. But he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? You're gonna make sure we all go down this shitter with you? I already told you. I'm taking both of you in, so let's go. This could have gone so well. To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you all fixed up. Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Take this Hey You're done, Wolf. Come on, we're pretty much done here. Ah. Are you kidding me? I'd like to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad to see your insides turned out. Uh. 
I'm glad to see not killing you didn't completely fuck me over. W. This way. The hell out of my way. Hmm. Oh shit! Kick, 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 kick! I'm not quite sure what the two arrows mean. Kick! Oh. Hey. I think most of New York is seeing this. I'm gonna be in some trouble, aren't I? W W W W Shit. Fuck what was that Gotcha Oh, now you've done it. Get your ass back up, Bigby! I kind of made a split second decision. Oh, you. Gun it! Are you sure? Do it! Oh, bitch, I don't think so! I really didn't want George, but... Why is she defending him? Come on. Putting in power. This just doesn't... I don't get it. There's nothing here to really see. Alright. I would rather go around to the back. Or can I deflate the tires? Holy shit. Why is he bleeding that much? I didn't think they normally... Out of here. How did this happen, Georgie? 
How did it get there? Fuck. Well, it won't be your fault. Hi, guys. Shit. Hello, Bigby. I hoped you'd come to your senses. <laughs> oh. Crooked man's the one you want. I know he but is. Of course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. I'm taking you in, Georgie. Let's go. <sighs> You're gonna carry me? Please, Sheriff. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. You can't seriously want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, it's I know spell. he made a few mistakes. We all have. What? what? He made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Doesn't that bother you even a little, knowing that man of murdered... Of course it does. Those girls... So it's all my fucking fault, then. I you didn't fucking... mean... Ah! You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf, too? You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? I did what I had to! You can't fucking blame me for that. Look. Why'd you do it, then, huh? If it's not your fault, then what the fuck happened? Ooh. Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them. And then he fucking sold me out. You're still the one who pulled the trigger. Nobody held your hand and made you go through with it. Ryan, believe what you want. I can tell you've made up your mind. Doesn't matter if it's fucking true or not. Go ahead and arrest me then. But it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. We'll get the crooked man. It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. Job's done. No right. one said the job was George done. Is the bad guy. It's all his fucking fault. But what was I supposed to do? You don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? You could have done anything else. You could have let them go. You could have freed Faith and Lily from those fucking ribbons instead of murdering them. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them... What would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me, if Free Lily meant she had to die... Do you still think I had a fucking choice? What are you doing? What are you talking about? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep our girls quiet. To ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But you know what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? We were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here, either. Wait, those were your ribbons? You're in on this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand, nobody was supposed to die. Yeah, but they when did. built this place, it, it was just a stupid idea. A gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. That's how it started, anyway. This was supposed to be our place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. And the crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... <clears throat> if you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her, then. What are you doing? Break the spell. 
Save the fucking day! We'll find another way. She she doesn't have to die. Maybe the witches Don't talk can about me like I'm not even here. Please. You think this is hard for you? My life is such a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't I get a say? It's my life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. You're right. It's your life. I know what I've done. Wait. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just do what they want with my life. I thought it would be different here, but it's all the fucking same. Vivian, I didn't mean... Do you think I wanted to be this person? What I did to Faith and Lily? To all of them? Vivian, wait, I... Every day I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. I have to forget what I've done to them, what I took away from them. I look at Nerissa and I hate myself. Vivian! I can't pretend anymore. What are you doing? Vivian, don't! Oh. Oh. Goodbye, Vivian, Georgie. no! Fuck! No, 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 no! Oh, well, fuck! Vivian! Vivian! Damn it! Vivian, I didn't fucking mean it. I was just... Oh. Uh, you know what? Fuck! Get up. Get up. Don't think so, Big B. From a knife? I'm gonna wound? die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Really fuck him up for me, all right? For both of us. Don't worry about the crooked man. <sighs> Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. You want to finish me off now? <laughs> or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Rip my limbs off one by one? That's what you want to do, right? That's not who I am. Prove it then. No more games, all right? We both know how this ends. <laughs> Just make it quick. I know what uh. I did. <laughs> Let's not draw this out. All right, Georgie. God damn. I don't understand why he died. All right, folks. Well, we'll cut here. As always, thanks for watching. Tune in the next. Thanks for watching, everybody. Ah, what's going on?